Hey everybody, uh, this is Duramadine. I am going to be doing the review for the full version of Internet Explorer 9 RTM. I did a review for the beta, and yes, I did have the RC, but now I'm on the full version, the final RTM. Show you the real deal. Yep, Internet Explorer 9. RTM and there's a version number five point you know nine point oh point eight eighty one twelve and you can always get it from beauty of the web dot com. I'm using my other laptop here. Yes it's, it's I finally got the charge. I'm I have it on a flat surface for the soldering to make contact. Let me show you the real deal that I got Windows 7, which will, I was gonna show you some proof that I'm running Windows 7. I found, today I just installed Surface Pack 1 after I installed the full version of Internet Explorer 9. And yes, this is 32-bit Windows 7 that's on this laptop. The other laptop got Internet Explorer 9 and Service Pack 1 as well. With that one, the other laptop got Windows 7 64 bit. And this is the where you can get the new Internet Explorer 9 from beautyoftheweb.com or from the Microsoft website. It says thank you for downloading. Let's say we want to make. I'm going to show you something cool that you can do with YouTube. Watch. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna drag it to my taskbar. See, look, look, this is what it does with certain websites like YouTube, Facebook, or whatever. It changes like the color of your arrows. It turns them into an app. Go ahead and unpin it. Here's a downfall that I've had another a bug Some, I don't know if it's an Internet Explorer or a Flash Player let's go to one of my videos oh my goodness it started to work because earlier it didn't it just show nothing on the screen it was just black I'm surprised it's starting to work now. Okay, everyone. Well, and I'm going to go ahead and play my video. Yep, it works pretty good now. It's finally working now on this computer. But the other one, I normally use Firefox. I gotta log in and stuff. But another YouTube user named known as Michael Yoshi fan. He ran and came to an issue on his with that his upload button won't show. And he has to use Windows XP to upload his video. Switch to Windows XP and use Internet Explorer 8. And Google you know Internet Explorer 9 includes HTML5 support. Let me start it back up. And you can see Internet Explorer got a new icon from the beta. And the title bars you see here are transparent. And it has quick startup as well. They added search suggestions instead of having a search bar like on Internet Explorer 7 and 8 would normally have on the right side. But now they put that when they were, they were doing work on the interface, they fixed it. 
so you can have more room on the web on the browser like put all the tabs right here the back and forward buttons right here and you got your address bar and you got refre the refresh buttons right here and that's to get to your favorites you go to this little star and this little gear you this is like where you all your settings but if you don't like the way Internet Explorer 9 if you want the old way I'm gonna show you you just right click right there you go to menu bar you want to go to favorites bar command bar that's how you can get some of the stuff back that Microsoft never removed some of the toolbars I'm gonna uncheck all that And it's pretty smooth. You can even look up a Wikipedia article. Yeah, and these are third party program so websites that we're using, we're utilizing. Let's look up PlayStation 3. Or, no, no, no. How about Windows 7? And there you go, if you want to learn some stuff about Windows 7. And here's another cool Windows site we can go and look. See, Windows Internet Explorer 9 pretty much loads pretty quick. And they did improve the security. They said they improved the malware protection up to 99%. And you got compatibility mode for older browsers for out of place things like menus, items, or text, which could be only compatible for old browsers. And I know my performance is a lot. It's probably because of Camtasia using up my memory. So I'm going to go ahead and give you the link to Internet Explorer 9, the full version. It's compatible with Windows Vista Service Pack 2. For when, If you're using Windows Vista Service Pack 2, you'll need the platform update. You want to make sure you have it installed and you'll need Internet Explorer 8 before installing Internet Explorer 9 on Vista but if you have Windows 7 or with or without Service Pack 1 you should be okay because you got Internet Explorer 8 it comes with Windows 7 Windows Vista comes with Internet Explorer 7 so Tell me what you think of Internet Explorer 9, and um, I'll talk to you guys on the comments, and I'm um, going to go ahead and start signing off.